Um, it's the old fella back if you knew it. Old Mr. Beer, whatever you want to call me. Right, this is a um, special, special request, if you like. Somebody's requested. Stephen King, not the author, has requested me to do uh, a Gordon Lightfoot uh, number. Wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald. Right, now, the story behind that was 1975, but he tells the story in the song. I know that. Um, Anyway, uh, he asked me to do this, and obviously it happened on the November the 10th, 1975. So this is obviously the 10th today when this has gone up. Um, and um, there you go. Um, so hopefully it goes up, because he is with uh, WMG. Um, so um, sometimes they block it. But this is, this is just the audio version, so hopefully it'll stay up. Um, but anyway... <laughs> Um, anyway, anyway, there we go. So this was requested, like I said, by Stephen King, and uh, there you go. Tells the story um, and um, about it because it was. Uh, anyway, I'm going to show up. And let Gordon Lightfoot tell you all about it. Let's get in there. Let's get him up here. Get these on and tick tock, take it away, Gordon. The legend lives on from the Chippewa on down of the big lake they call Gitchagumi. The lake, it is said, never gives up her dead when the skies of November turn gloomy. With a load of iron ore, 26,000 tons more than the Edmund Fitzgerald weighed empty. That good ship and true was a bone to be chewed when the gales of November came early. The ship was the pride of the American side Coming back from some mill in Wisconsin As the big freighters go, it was bigger than most With a crew and good captain well seasoned Concluding some terms with a couple of steel firms When they left fully loaded for Cleveland Then later that night when the ship's bell rang Could it be the north wind they'd been feeling? Tattletail sound and the wave broke over the railing. And every man knew as the captain did too, twas the witch of November come stealing. The dawn came late and the breakfast had to wait when the gales of November came slashing. When afternoon came, it was freezing rain. In the face of a hurricane west wind When supper time came The old cook came on deck Saying, fellas, it's too rough to feed you 7 p.m. a main hatchway gave in He said, fellas, it's been good to know ya The captain wired in, he had water coming in And the good ship and crew was in peril and Later that night when his lights went out of sight Came the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald
Does anyone know where the love of God goes when the waves turn the minutes to hours? The searchers all say they'd have made Whitefish Bay if they put 15 more miles behind her. They might have split up or they might have capsized. They may have broke deep and took water. And all that remains is the faces and the names of the wives and the sons and the daughters. Lake Huron Rose Superior sings in the rooms of her ice water mansion. Oh, Michigan steams like a young man's dreams. The islands and bays are for sportsmen. And farther below Lake Ontario takes in what Lake Erie can send her. The iron boats go as the mariners all know with the gales of November remembered. In a musty old hall in Detroit they prayed in the maritime sailors Cathedral. The church bell chimed till it rang 29 times for each man on the Edmund Fitzgerald. And the legend lives on from the Chippewa down of the big lake they call Gitchagumi. Superior, they said, never gives up her dead when the gales of November come early. go there you go that's just uh, in memory of of course um oof. yeah no one survived 29 lives lost in the sinking oh. there you go and um that's uh, a special reason for doing it so that's it um i'm not going to react to it in in the way i normally uh, uh, normally would with the song it's there to pay respect and um, to people and uh and to remember what happened back on that uh on that gruesome day if you like because of the weather and uh there you go this has come from uh gordon lightfoot's um channel anyway so hopefully it, it gets up there. So if you do, if you are a fan of Gordon Lightfoot, then go and check his channel out for sure. Um, I mean, incredible to actually come up with the song about it and put all the lyrics together, that's for sure. But anyway, there you go, folks. This is a tribute or a, a remembrance of, of uh, that in 1975. Anyway, thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you so much for all your comments and all your support and everything else. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And of course, please, 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 stay safe, old fella. We'll be back. Bye for now.